Hi everybody, welcome back to another Little Geeks Little Holidays video. Today's video comes from friends at Nintendo. Thank you so much Nintendo for sending us whatever's in this box for free to share with you. So let's get this open and check them out. Open. Oh, check it out everybody, we got Pokemon Violet. So there's also Pokemon Scarlet, but this is available for $59.99 and it is for ages... Well, it's for E. It's E for everyone, so... And this this game is in Paldea, which is based off of Spain. I finished the game already, so I know a lot of stuff about it. I'm still working on it. There are terror raid battles, which you can participate in, where if you played Sword and Shield, they're similar to the Max Raid Dens. You could pick between Sprigatito, Quaxley, and Foycoco as your starter, which are the crocodile, the duck, and the cat. I chose the cat. You start off in, like I said, Spain. It's more of an open world journey, so there's no set path that you could, that you like, make, they make you take, like some it's of the less other games. Like, it's not really like Legend Arceus. It's kind of like Legend Arceus, how you run around talking to people. It's just like an open map, but you you don't have to unlock anything. There's three paths that you can take. As you do the gym leaders, you can unlock more Pokemon levels that you're able to battle with. The one problem with being able to roam around freely during the game and pick your path is that you might have to look up charts on what order to do them in because there are set gym levels. So like um, the normal type gym and the ice type gym you're going to want to do towards the end because they're like level 50 and up. So I, when you choose the Titan path and then you're all you're going to end up doing all of them. You can unlock new abilities for your ride legendary, like swimming, sprinting, jumping higher, climbing, flying. And then after you finish all your gyms, you finish the game basically. And then you go to the great crater where you find your paradox Pokemon. We should have said spoiler warning before this. Um, when you do that, you can battle your, like, it's basically the antagonist of the game. And then you're basically going to finish the game. And then you can rematch every gym leader. And then when you finish that, like kind of after credit story, you unlock seven star terror raids. Pokemon Violet is basically the same thing as Pokemon Scarlet, except you go to a different academy. It's like the same. You go to a different academy, you have a different legendary Pokemon. You, I think... Maridon is... That's, that's Karidon. Karidon. That's Karidon. This is Maridon. So the academy is basically the same. They just sport different colors and they have a different logo. They also have different... Um, what's it called? They have different Paradox Pokemon. Yeah, and this one takes place in the past and this one takes place in the future. So it should be mentioned that Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet are separate. They're $59.99 each or you can get the double pack. They, um... You don't need both of the games to complete your Pokedex, I don't think. I think they have separate Pokedexes, but as you register them from different games, it will add on to it. Like, it stops at 400 exactly. I, like, if I register Maridon from his game, it's probably going to go to 401. I already finished Scarlet, so I can tell you for certain it will make a great little holiday gift. So we've played this game a lot, and we'll show you a little clip of it, and I'll tell you if it will make a great little holiday gift. Also, a little cool thing, it shows you the map of the game inside of the case. So let's get to the couch and check it out. Couch, couch. Hey everybody, we're in the game, we're, and me and Little Ninja are in a group right now, which is like a mode that you have to do. Right now, with my progress, I have Garchomp. Iron Hands. Iron Hands, which I got from trading Vanguard, which I got from trading, oh, almost all of these I got from trading Crinfish. Pomo and Falink. I call it Falink. That's supposed to be a brook I think that might be a little... I don't know. Alright. So we're gonna go catch a Pokemon. Alright. I'm good. Now. There's also an auto battle feature where if you uh, press the R button while you have a Pokemon in your first slot, you can have them auto battle with you. So let's see. There's that. I think I have like two shinies right now in the game. I have... I was the first one to get a shiny though. I have five. I'm gonna go to this spot right here. I'm gonna go to the terrestrialized cave. On the side up. The first time I... That's a little ninja. If 
fine if that's how you want to play. That poor little Psyduck. <laughs> <laughs> you just saw me back there, that explosion. He just killed him with Coridon. He fainted. He didn't die. Fine. I will just just get over it with uh, Ultra Ball. Just stay in my ball. Yay! Quick capture! And that's how you catch a Pokemon, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. And it's also how you exploit a Pokemon, Scarlet and Violet. Oh, it's a Gumshoes, okay. And then you can also go in your menu to Poke Portal and join anyone else's um, terror raid. And you could also start a picnic like this if you want to hunt Pokemon. So right now I have all my Pokemon out, you just can't see it. This is a terrestrialized Pokemon that you can find in the wild. If you see that yellow glare, that means it's a Pokemon and not a cave. Let's see what this one is. It is a Meowth. And then this is a terrestrialized cave. Oh! Do you have one yet? No. So I'm gonna do challenge as a group. One-shotted! I mean, it was a tandem mouse and you had a Garchomp. I'd be a little disappointed in you if you didn't one-shot that. Except usually he doesn't listen since I caught him in the wild and I didn't even have to evolve. Oh, that's why you do the gyms. Come here, ball. Like, if you had just started the game and you had to catch a Pokemon, you'd probably be like, it'd probably take a couple hits, but I have Garchomp, which is like, really good compared to this, so. So that's open world and catching. As you can see, it's a lot of fun, so let's get back to the table and wrap it up. So, table, right, table. ready? That's Pokemon Violet and Scarlet. We hope you enjoyed the gameplay. We gave you a whole bunch of good insights. The two pack is available now for $119.99 and Scarlet and Violet separately are available now for $59.99. Each of them is for Nintendo Switch and Little Zombie. I think this will make a great little holiday gift. Definitely. Even a stocking stuffer. Thank you so much Nintendo for sending this to us for free. Thank you so much everybody for watching another Little Geeks little holiday video. We'll see you next time. Bye. Notes on Little Geeks for more toys and more fun. Please like our video and subscribe for our YouTube channel.